Pam, Pam here from How To Pam. And today I'm going to show you the safe use of a chainsaw. First and foremost, your safety equipment. Safety glasses, your gloves, and your boots. So what we're going to do first is we're going to add the fuel. But let me tell you about my chainsaw. There's many different varieties out there. And I got a gas-powered one, just for doing little jobs around the house. It's economical. So now what you have is you have gasoline and mixed with a two-stroke motor oil at a ratio of 32 to 1. Let me give it a good mix. Make sure it's mixed good before you add it. Add it in there. Fill it up. There we go. And then we have our oil, our chain bar oil, so that the chain can run smoothly over the bar. Easy enough. Add that. Not bad, it didn't spill. Okay, it's fueled up, oiled. You're going to want to file your chain, make sure it's sharp to do the job. And we have a 732 chainsaw file. Okay, and then what you're going to do on a 37 degree angle, as you're going forward, you're going to twist the bar, going in an upward motion. Okay, and two or three strokes per tooth. And then you've got the different side teeth, right? Going on a 37 degree angle. And again, you twist it as you go up. And two or three strokes per each is good. And the other tool here, if your chainsaw, <coughs> if your chain becomes loose, you have this little tool that usually comes with your chainsaws. You can loosen these because here is where you would actually tighten with this end to tighten your chain and then you would tighten these back up. Okay? So then once we have that done, we're going to start it. So now I put it on the ground to give me leverage and they usually have a little footstep for you. So I'm going to turn it on. Pull the choke out there we go, and prime it. And where's my little? There we go. And you give it a couple of pushes on that, and then you try. Thanks for visiting me. I hope you enjoyed it. 
at How To Pam.